Guys, uh, we're down 200. A 30 year yield is at an all time low. Uh, all time low? Close to 191. Uh, and Exxon below 60 for the first time wow. since 2010. There's the new, the, new, get, the new tobacco. No one believes me, but it Let's is. get to Seema Modi. Hey, Seema. Hey, Carl. The Dow fighting to stay above 29,000. The major averages once again pulling back from record highs. As you point out, a lot of the cues being taken from the bond market. The 10-year yield sinking to its lowest levels of the year. Uh, lowest levels in September now. Propping up some of the rate sensitive sectors. You'll see the utilities right now in the green. Big question is how much has the coronavirus fears impacted earnings estimates? Well, going into this year, profits were expected to grow over 6% in the first quarter. Today, Wall Street has cut that estimate by half to around 3%, weighed down by major cuts in the deep cyclicals like autos and energy. But the sector that has arguably been hit the most is. Uh, the cruise lines by those coronavirus fears. Norwegian yesterday on its earnings call, despite not having exposure to China, said that it is canceling all cruises in Asia uh, till September of this year. You can see all those cruise lines are down on the week. Take a look, though, at shares of Deer. It's up about 8 percent, biggest earnings beat in nearly three years, and it follows positive comments from Deer CEO John May. He's seeing early signs of stabilization in the U.S. farm sector, also says farm confidence uh, those still subdued has improved. Deer's optimism uh, following similar commentary from some of its peers in the agricultural equipment space, Agco, Mosaic, and CF Industries. Now the big question is, how is coronavirus impacting its global business? Conference call starts at 10 a.m. and I will be on it.